Hey y'all, hey. So we have some jam jar and I am, we got the sweet red blend and the, thank you, my friend just handed it to me. And the sweet Shazazz, Shiraz. Wow. Clearly I need to read Shiraz. <laughs> So we are going to taste the sweet Shiraz. Now that y'all know, um, allegedly this is trending. So I'll take this opportunity to let you all know that you should subscribe to my channel and make sure you like and comment. Okay. Cheers. I don't know what it's supposed to be supposed to taste like but I mean it's definitely sweet I mean it's good I don't know that it's completely different from any red wine that I've had in the past aside from um, it's not like a super strong taste what would you say um, my friend in the background <laughs> I ain't gonna say her name but <laughs> We just taste it. It's not overwhelmingly sweet. It has like a nice balance between a little sweet and a little dry. Mm -hmm. And so, if you're not a person who really likes dry red, this would be it. So, reviewing the wow. sweet Shiraz. And so, it's really good. I, I would recommend this for people who are looking for something that's kind of sweet. Um, it's a nice transitional wine. If if you like Pinot Noir, it's kind of like a milder version of that. It's sweet, but it's not like dry, like something like Pinot Noir or um, any other dry red wine. So I would highly recommend this one. And I'm going to try the other one, the sweet, sweet blend. So now we have the Jam Jar Sweet Red Blend 2020. And we're gonna pop this baby open and see what it tastes like. Ooh, y'all heard that? <laughs> Let me tell you about my friends and my spouse. They in the background. It was suggested, oh, review the wine. Nobody wants to be on camera but me. Y'all see how my friends do me? So this is the sweet. <laughs> You want to be on camera, Toy? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm throwing your name out there now. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is the sweet red blend. Okay, this one tastes different from the other one. <laughs> Obviously. I am not a wine connoisseur, so I don't know what this tastes like, but it's not, it's not super sweet like the sweet, Shiraz, it's more, and this is where it would be helpful if my friends and my spouse would help me with this. So pause, brief intermission while I consult. Mm -hmm. All right, so we back after consulting the people. Wow. Sweet red blend. This is what I'm drinking. Um, so it's definitely not sweet like the bottle says. I had to take it again just to make sure. <laughs> it smells like a Pinot Noir. It's definitely drier than the other one. Um, kind of fruity, definitely not sweet. Still tastes good, but it's not sweet. But I think this is still a good transitional wine because it, I mean, it's still not as dry as your typical Pinot Noir or Merlot or anything in that class of wines but again I am not a wine connoisseur but if you are looking for some options for your table how much does this cost $11. they are about $11 a bottle and where we get them from you can get them from your local Benny's if you have them are they available in any other store Go to Benny's if you have a Benny's in your town or if you want to search online. Certainly, it'll tell you where these are located. Um, but 
husband saw him on social media. Allegedly is trending. Don't know. But so between the two, I would highly recommend the sweet Shiraz. Again, it's a nice transitional line. It's sweet. Um, it's not dry and I'm not like a huge wine person, but it's definitely something that you can drink and you would um, you can pair it with like a dessert or just like your dinner or something. <laughs> but it's it's definitely enjoyable. Um, but I mean, the sweet red blend is good as well. It's just really amount of, about your preference. And if you prefer like a drier wine, I would suggest the sweet red blend. Cause it's more like a Pinot Noir Merlot. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching my channel. We have exceeded 2000 subscribers. Let me just point that out. We're at like 2061 or something like that. And so the plan is to do something special for reaching such a huge milestone. Cause if you do any social media or anything like that, especially YouTube, you know that it can be a struggle trying to get subscribers. Um, but I do really appreciate you guys tuning into my channel and I hope that you continue to support and like, comment, share, subscribe, all of the above. Um, and yeah, thank you for being here.